All right, Nico, go ahead and take it away. Okay, for sure. So, hey everyone. So, for those who haven't met me, I'm Nico Antonio, currently a freshman, and I'm running to be your treasurer for the next year. And honestly, let me just start off by saying how ironic it is I'm giving you a speech to be a treasurer because among my friends, I'm kind of known for my roach, quote unquote, roach behavior because there have been so many times where I've just been that broke in my life. Not even like my fault, like just things just happen. And like, I've definitely not eaten a couple times so that I could go out for another day or I would sell like not only my recyclables, but my friends' recyclables too so that I wouldn't have to spend my own money when I go out. And this sounds like kind of like, <laughs> like kind of like weird to say and it doesn't sound as good but I think what I've most taken away from these experiences and I hope what you can see based off of this is that I've always found a way to make it through any situation I'm in and no matter what I have or have been given I can always find a way to achieve my own goals despite all adversity that I'm working against and although for these experiences the goals at hand were more social the values I had to make the best of my situation and find a solution are transferable to many other experiences and opportunities. So previous leadership experiences that I've held prior to coming to USC include the treasurer position of Girl Up and the vice president position of Pre-Med Society, both at my previous high school. And then I feel both positions have allowed me to learn and grow into the leader that I am today. So as treasurer of Girl Up, I managed the finances of our club, which primarily included that of like collaborating with lo local businesses to work on fundraisers so that we could raise money to help donate to the Girl Up organizations so that we could help eliminate the barriers to girls in third world countries, while also managing the club bank account and updating the other officers of the club of our financial standings. And when I was vice president of pre-med society, I managed a lot of the administrative work, which meant relaying information from the presidents to the other officers and completing like set tasks on the agenda and running the general meetings as well. And what I hope you can see from these is that I'm not credible to be treasurer simply because I've had other leadership positions, but because um, I'm an experienced communicator who knows how to work within a group to collaborate on assigned tasks and get them done, as seen by the work I've completed in my other clubs. So perhaps what I'm most in experienced in, however, is just simply being a Filipino. Like, I don't know much about the culture and I've never been in a large Filipino community like this before. But now that I am, I hope to do more for the community now that I'm a part of it. And if you know me, you know that I'm a very social person with many people having stories of me meeting them at times that I don't even remember anymore. But I just love talking to people and love spending time with like all the new people I've met, let that be my espresso family, the philo freshmen, the spring interns, or even just like the friends I've made doing homework at Levy. And I want to do more for the community because I love everyone who's a part of it. And I love what Troy Phi stands for. And I hope um, and I hope that my social experiences will be beneficial in communicating with um, like the local other with like the other e-board members and the general members of the club as well. So as treasurer, you guys put not only your money with me, but your trust as well. You trust that the money you give to the club is properly utilized to fund the events that benefit the entirety of all the members and that all the funds are responsibly budgeted. And beyond just my experience as treasurer for another club, working as a server and a team member at the UC Bookstore has given me insight and experience in managing other people's money. And while these jobs typically dealt with delivering the experience to the customer, I feel that it aligns sort of with the job as a treasurer to provide the members of the club with the means to organize events. And as treasurer, not only eboard, um, but the general members of the club as well, will kind of look to me to ensure that I provide what is what they pay for and that the funds for the club are properly budgeted and documented and relayed amongst all the other members or all the other officers of the club. So commitment, communication, and community. These are all areas which I've thrived in and are all transferable values and skills that I will apply to the position if I'm elected. My commitment to completing what I have to do because I can handle the sacrifice to ensure that I get what is important accomplished. My previous experiences in leadership positions have given me the communication skills that would allow me to succeed as a treasurer of the club to plan and manage the finances and work with the other members of board. And most importantly, my devotion to the people as part of this club motivates me to ensure that I do my very best for the Filipino community here at USC. And I may not have the most experience for the job. What I hope you can see from what I've said is that I've been a part of many organizations already, like Girl Up, Pre-Med, the Pre-Law Fraternity here at USC and Troy And although there isn't much congruity in like all the different things I'm a part of, 
I hope you can see that what motivates me is my desire to learn more and be a part of the community. And this is what I think will make me a successful treasurer for you guys because I'm still learning every day and I want to keep learning. Thank you for listening to me and I hope you guys give me the chance to become a better leader as your treasurer for the next year.